You know, people always go on at this stage of the season about integrity of the competition and, and, and not fucking around too much with your team, I guess. This is a game against a Swindon team who are in a similar position to yourself where you can. Yeah, well, also there's rules and regs that you, you've got to stick to the rules. I think it's 10 of the last squad that have got to be involved and listen, we want to win a game of football. It's not that we're going to make wholesale changes and change four, five, six, seven. No, it's one that we might think, yeah, is he deserves an opportunity of late from the 23s. We've brought in the Courtney, so it's no different to what we've done throughout the season. It just, at this moment, without chasing for a playoff, might give us a little room for opportunity for another buddy. But that's a decision that I'm still playing around with at this moment in time. Um, in terms of your, your squad, I know you're thinking about next season, but, but you've got a lot of players here now played an awful lot of games at a very young age, but the, uh, the ideology of the club is, is develop players, but that then brings other clubs in looking at those players. Yeah. So it's, it's a difficult balance act to try and keep this group together, the ones you want to keep. I just, we know that, we, we know budgets throughout the leagues and different things, and these boys now become major players in this division and also huge ass, like big assets for the club. So the, the, the boys that have come in have done terrifically well, um, and that's, again, it's, it's a little bit, you know, you look at it and think, yeah, we haven't got it ourselves into the playoffs, but I'm really, really proud and pleased on some of the, the boys' performances and the team performances this year. I think they've been, on times, ex exceptional. It's just we haven't been able to, to put games to bed, which I think we've, we've, we've got to learn on and try and improve on in the summer.